This thing will change the way you fly drones. This is crazy. When you have to fly really close to things and you really have to see the details, the image looks great. This lens really does a great job. I've gotten something extremely exciting in the mail today. So this is the Magi Mask mask. Well, not really a mask. I, I wouldn't call it mask, but well, that's the name of it. So these are basically goggles for your phone. You put your phone here and you turn your phone screen into your goggle screen. And you can use this for many different things. But what I am most interested in is using this for flying the drone. And I have a feeling that this will change the way I can fly the regular drone because it makes your phone screen look like a huge movie screen. I'm actually quite surprised how well this lens, you do it like this, you open it up, you put your phone here, you close it up, you can, um, you can get your USB through here. So when you control your drone, you use the USB cable, plug it into the controller. Then you can change the focusing distance of this thing by just like unlocking this thing and then see, I like it when it's somewhere around here. This is my perfect distance. And then you lock it and you're ready to go. Let's stop talking and let's go and actually experience the flight with this thing. Let's see how well does it improve my flying capabilities. Yeah, abilities. You have to remember to dial in the settings before you fly because well, when you're flying, you won't be able to access the screen. So uh, closer the, it gets, the bigger the screen, but I kind of like it when it's here. Lock it and uh, now we're basically ready. Ready to fly. And it works with glasses too, so. <laughs> All right, so let's let's take this thing for a spin. Let's start the recording. Wow, this is very funky. Wow, this screen. It's like in my face. It really feels like I'm in a cinema right now, looking at a big screen. This is, uh, this is funky, very funky. All right, let's approach this crane right here. Let's get real close. Let's get the details of it. Let's, let's use this mask as it should be used. I think the best uh, way I have to use this is like, when you have to fly really close to things and you really have to see the details and the objects you are capturing, this will help a lot. This is a very good replacement for an iPad because I would say that this type of looking at screen is even like, it feels even bigger than a huge iPad in your hands. Definitely. It really feels like a cinema, cinema screen. This is crazy. And the resolution is fine. If my phone would have even better resolution, that would that would make it look even better. But uh, well, the Retina screen on the iPhone mini, iPhone 12 mini is totally fine. I can see some pixelation, but that's because the phone screen is right off my face. But uh, all in all, the image looks great. This lens really does a great job with like enlarging the screen. This is so cool. All right, let's check out the beautiful part of this place. So this building right here in the center, the white one with the green facade element is a beautiful building. They are selling apartments here. And those apartments are like renovated and uh, kept in the old style, really fancy looking some uh, amazing apartments right there so this is the quiet center of riga by the way uh, one one more thing this thing these goggles this mask is great at is like i can see the wires when i get when i fly close to them i can see them really well so no worries about the wires and I gotta say, the experience is, it kind of feels like FPV, but the only thing is I cannot dive this drone. I can only, uh, 
I can only fly it like normally. Oh, let's catch this bird maybe. All right, let's get one more shot of a building. Right here, this funky, I don't know how this is, the dome. Yeah, it's a dome. Yeah, beautiful dome. Now let's get a shot with me. Oh, another bird. Maybe it's the same one. All right, precision and a rotating backwards upwards flight with the dome in the center i can really see all of the imperfections i get with my controls on this screen it really exaggerates everything i gotta say it's uh it's quite amazing to fly because uh you can see all of the details that are there on the screen that drone sees. You can see all of the imperfections you achieve with being not so great with controlling the drone. So you will see everything you do. Now we're back from the flight and I gotta say, this thing is incredible. It really is like going to a movie theater and like flying your drone with a 5G connection somewhere and you're just sitting in the movie theater and just checking out the big screen and controlling your drone. That's the feeling. That's how I experienced it. It makes you see everything so it can improve your precision. It can improve your uh, drone's health because you can see the wires, you can see small branches, you can see everything on your screen and you can really get immersed in the flight experience. Also one very important plus for this thing is that if you're in a very sunny scenario and there are no shades for you to hide in, you put your phone in and it's completely dark, you can concentrate on the image and no sunlight will interfere with your flying. Apparently there are these receivers that you can buy that you can connect to your phone. If you have an Android phone, you can connect the receiver to your phone and uh, basically fly analog drones with this setup. And actually yesterday I started looking at my like some of my older cinematic edits through this thing. It was like looking at them for the first time. And I gotta say, my, my shots look better on the big screen. If you have this thing, go check out some of my cinematic edits. You might be uh, surprised or not, I don't know. This thing is really, really cool. Video watching experience was insane and drone flying experience is insane. And you can even connect an analog drone to it. It's like, what else do you need? I really do recommend this thing. If you want to get your own, go check the link in the description. For all of you who have been flying FPV, you, you know what this is. You know how it feels when you're looking at a big screen inside the goggles and like seeing everything. But for all you who haven't flown FPV, I gotta say, it's amazing. Go check it out. Link will be in the description. If you want it, get your own and experience the flying in a way that you have never experienced it before. Hopefully you were able to enjoy this video. If you did, you know what to do. If you want to see more, you also know what to do and uh, see you in the next video.